Valentine's Day. Happy day. <laughs> What's up guys? Happy Valentine's Day. I know that you guys won't be watching it on Valentine's Day, but that's what today is. So happy Valentine's Day. Uh, Matt and I are going to go to breakfast with my parents. So that's gonna be nice. And then- How romantic. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're gonna cook me dinner tonight, so. Oh. Oh. That's romantic. And then. News to me! He's gonna be working from wherever we are. I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna get into today, so. Anyway, me in the bumper, ready for breakfast. I don't know if you can see it. It's there. It's definitely there. Me in the bumper. <laughs> Is your bump ready? Yeah. <laughs> uh, so right now where we are waiting on um, Pertinellis Electric Company to see if we uh, how many poles we need put in and what kind of electrical we actually need uh, placed before our electrician comes in and actually starts his work or gives his quote. So uh, we're trying to orchestrate all of that. So the electrician's coming today. Uh, Pertinellis is coming like literally any time. So I just keep looking. Like ah, they're coming. But um, yeah. That's, uh, that's, we're hoping for some good news because uh, there's a potential that we might have to have two poles or might have to dig down for a, a good ways. Uh, so we're trying to just reduce the pain as much as possible. Yeah, total cost, we'll see. It's gonna be expensive either way. Uh, the other thing that we're doing today is digging some holes. So um, I'm gonna try to knock out a few more holes. If I feel that's too tiring, then I'm gonna go clear some, some property. But that's not helping the house, it's just easier work. No. There's a van. You're just gonna do holes. That van's not for us. Nope. Dang! Just just do holes? Yeah. All right. Only house stuff, I can help. Here, bring me the dogs, let the dogs out. Brady's just gonna bark. Brady, come on! Brady, come on! Good boy! Go, Buzz! Go! Go! Yay! Don't drop your toy. Don't drop it. Don't. Just me another dog video. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so uh, there's two options that we have. We can either um, go directly off the pole that's on the other side of the property. Oh, we can? Yes, but we have to basically they drop a line down for us after they put a um, transformer up there. So they'll put a transformer up there. What that does basically, uh, they just put a meter loop on that side, which will then give us 120, or I mean, basically the voltage that we need. It mm -hmm. kind of steps it down. And so from there, uh, they can either, we can trench it ourselves, which we're probably gonna do. We're gonna get a rock saw. So, and there's another company that I was looking at. Uh, he does it for almost nothing. So we may go that route or we may save that money and put it somewhere else and just rent a rock saw. I have a guy that already rents rock saws too at Wimberley. That's one option, which then we'd have to trench all the way to the house, which is, is fine. It's three, it's, it's a football field <laughs> size of trenching. Uh, it's very doable um, and actually ends up saving money in certain regards. Yeah, so it saves money in a way. Uh, it also saves trees because the other way we'd actually run a line all the way down where we drive in every day. And so it would be a line with poles right where our driveway is. And we'd have to cut all the trees in a straight line mm -hmm. uh, to make sure it's clear on 10 feet on each side. Um, so yeah, we'd have to cut all those trees. And so it's a good amount of, of, of trees down. We have to cut a like a lot of trees down if we do that. So we're getting the estimates for both. So uh, okay. whether they just put a transformer up or they put a transformer and a overhead line that goes most of the way. Either way, we still have to trench some. Um, but it'd be a lot like, we can trench by hand if it's the overhead one. Uh, but more than likely, we're just gonna have to trench all the way from that, that pole over there. But if you think about that, where does the driveway run? <laughs> it runs in between those two. So we're gonna have to cut the driveway up. A little bit, just, so just a little line. So it's going to be the first option, what it sounds like. Well, we're going to have to cut through the driveway a little bit. So we're, we'll do, like, cut through the driveway, put the uh, electric in, and... Jeez. <laughs> and basically uh, patch it the same day. So, which is very doable. It's all doable. It only takes a couple hours to trench that whole distance. Like, maybe two or three hours. It's taking so. you, like, two weeks to do that? By hand! <laughs> So then you and can do the rest once. of that one with the trench. Right, thing. yeah. I can finish out the rest. So we have a plan for everything. We're just uh, waiting on estimates uh, to be to make the final decision. How long will those take? Uh, a week or so. But we so. can do other stuff in the meantime. Yeah. Okay. 
we can't put the containers in because I'm I need that decision before I can trench because I, I, I want the panels which I'll ask you this here in a little bit I, can, I think I want the panels on the far side of the house in other words or like kind of on the back or maybe on the back corner side and we'll, we'll figure that out but what I can do is instead of trenching all the way around I can just trench directly through so the the more direct we can get the less copper wire we'll have to buy you know in a sense so yeah so that's our life right now we're still in the dirt but progress do you have any idea how much it'll be I know it's under 10,000 I know it's under that is that what you were thinking uh, I was just hoping it wasn't above that for some reason because you know all the other because we had some very big unknowns <laughs> so tell me okay Matt so what is what is our next step for the uh, the house show me the, <laughs> show me the holes that you dug <laughs> then we'll go over the uh, the next step one more page. what you reading thrones oh Windy. You gotta use this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> yeah, hey! <laughs> he looks happy. So You're a jerk. I think this one's my favorite hole. It's a good hole. They're good, right? So how many are there total? Uh, on this side, there's eight. On that side, there's four with four more coming. Basically, yeah, the, we've already talked about the holes once before, but now they're just almost done. Uh, we didn't do any of the, the center holes, like basically the structural side. So this is the exterior wall right here. And so I'm going to make these holes just a little bit bigger, um, basically be able to take the full dead load of everything. Uh, the roof, the container. I think this side has, I mean, obviously it has a bathroom. It's going to have a baby in it, all kinds of stuff. So basically just want to make sure the house doesn't fall over. So yeah, we're uh, putting uh, concrete footings on this side. Uh, the next step really is uh, we have to get concrete poured. Um, I'm meeting with my business partner that's helping me out on this uh, on Tuesday, and we'll probably talk a little bit then about, about things. Yeah, next step is basically uh, pour concrete and get all that ready uh, besides finishing out the rest of the budget. So once we have all that, then we're... Uh, we're good to finish like basically start on everything but again we're just waiting for that so we're like a week or two out from really pushing forward hard bad weather came i couldn't finish out the holes right here and so we we're waiting on that plus uh septic it's like just trying to get a guy here for septic it's like everyone does cleaning no one really does installation so that's really fun uh, but I finally actually, uh, I talked to one of my clients who does the boxes. Like, so he distributes boxes to, I guess, septic installers. I never thought about that until like a week ago. And so I got some names from him and so I'm pursuing that right now. But that's the last piece of everything. It's going to be, it's going to be expensive, but it's, uh, we're building it into the budget. So we know what we're in for. But, uh, yeah, digging holes, we're going to have to possibly rent uh, a rock, rock saw. And that's going to be fun. That'd be a good video. <laughs> we'll attach a camera right to the front of the rock saw and just watch it churn out everything. Yeah, this, this section I'm, I'm digging by hand. The previous holes that I did, I am making them bigger. It's uh, I do want as much stability as possible. Uh, the interior uh, won't need as much uh, as far as footings go, just because it's only supporting that middle area, which is not a, it's not really bearing a load, uh, not enough of one to justify for larger holes like this. We are, I'm learning a lot. <laughs> But, uh, and digging a lot. And Brady's helping a little bit. And then actually we're clearing a bunch of land. So last time, which has nothing to do with the house except for just being nice. It's like a, kind of our backyard. We just had this little area cleared back here. Yeah, so we cleared all the way behind those trees. And so you can drive a car all the way back there right now. Well, as soon as we burn everything that's back there. So that's uh, the update that we have for right now until Tuesday. Well, thanks for watching guys, and I uh, hope you learned something, because I didn't. But uh, yeah, these are the, the new holes. This is what's happening, and I uh, hope a lot, lot, lot comes uh, from the next two weeks. So uh, definitely stay tuned for that. It'll, it'll be a lot more interesting once the containers are on the ground, <laughs> I promise. But uh, yeah, until then, hope you all have fun out there. Bye. All right, you can, I don't know.
maybe dinner or something. I always do. <laughs> That's what it's the last thing food sees. <laughs> 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 What? Hurry, get up there. Go. 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 (laughs) (laughs) Oh. I know. Which one is it? Brady. 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 Trees. Trees. So. What? <laughs> you wanna play? Brady, what do you think? You wanna go play? Give <laughs> <laughs> it back to him. Well, first, show me your holes. The holes that you dug. Show me. Show me your holes. <laughs> 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 <laughs>